It's her. Yeah, that's her. That's her. Here she comes. She's coming. Three hours. Three hours. She is a maniac. <laughs> Here she is. That's her. Several years ago, reports emerged from various sources about a mysterious figure. One day, she just appeared on a sidewalk in a typical neighborhood in Northeast LA. Soon afterward, she was spotted in various widespread locations throughout the area. At the corner store, the dollar store, Target, Costco, the post office, multiple locations in the same day. Most importantly, some of these sightings occurred miles apart from each other, yet no one ever spotted her taking a car or other vehicle. She appeared to be walking on foot miles and miles on foot. Too many things about this story didn't add up. Our investigation tracked Dawn, covering as much as three miles in one day. The more we dug into Dawn's story, the more we smelled a mystery. Perhaps Dawn wasn't human. Maybe she was an engineered biotech product, some kind of android or perhaps even an alien. The more we questioned, the more we thirsted for answers. After numerous unsuccessful attempts to get Dawn to talk, we finally managed to get a remote interview with her. Hi, Dawn. Hi, Emily. Thanks for talking to me. It's really an honor. I've heard a lot of intriguing stories about you. So I heard that you walk. Yes. A lot. I started walking when I, when I first moved here, I moved in with my brother and his wife and I was afraid to walk. So my sister-in-law took me on walks. We, w we went on walks and I went on a walk on around the block and she told me to walk, turn every right on the block and then I'll be right back at the house. Wow. So on that first walk, um, what happened on that first walk? I was walking and I fell and I I slipped I tripped on my toe ring on my shoelace and a cat came out and and so I squirted it away squished it away and then I and then a rock came coming down and then I bumped into that and then a wobber came and we ran into each other. There was a tornado. There was a huge hurricane. I walked through a blizzard. A ninja jumped out of the bushes. A coyote spooked me. There was a crazy snowstorm. There was a flash flood. I may have seen a witch. That really happened? Um, that was actually a story I I was, I had a boring walk. Oh, so you mean those, those things didn't really happen? Yeah, those stories didn't really happen. <laughs> and now you live, you don't live with your brother anymore. Yeah, I live by my, I live with a roommate now. And I live in a whole new location. And I walk to the post office, I walk to the bonds, I walk to CVS Pharmacy. I can even walk to Trader Joe's and back. Wow, Dawn, it's like you're a superhero. I walked a thousand miles in one year. Like you have a superpower. I do. My superpower is my independence. I've walked to CVS Pharmacy. I've walked to Trader Joe's. I've walked to the post office. I've walked to church. I even walked to get our lessons. I even walked to the pharmacy, Mexican restaurant. 
to my brother's house and even Vaughn's and to the doctor's office. I've even walked to the place on the corner where I get my blood drawn in the corner market. I can also ride the bus alone and walk the rest of the way to the San Diego Mall.